Hey, this is Matt, developer of Server Steel, and I'm here to talk about some cool ways players have been uh, playing the demo I released. So this level, you're typically supposed to kick that door open and deal with all the guys in the hallway. But players found a way to use the arm cannon to carve a hole to the left of the door like you saw, which gets you into this hallway. It's a little bit safer, and there's some uh, nice weapons to find in there. A player did this cool thing where they throw their weapon down the hallway, and then fight through the hallway. By the time we're at the end of the hallway, you're low on ammo or you're out of ammo, and you have a, like a loaded weapon ready to go. When I first saw that, it blew my mind. I thought it was a super cool move. Uh, players have been doing cool stuff with Nicola and AI. So you saw I just got wrecked kicking down that door. But if I use the audio perception of the AI to kick a wall, lure them over, uh, you can set up ambushes. That's really useful in the harder difficulties where, in the hardest difficulty, one shot kills you. So that's been a really useful technique. There's one stunt in the game that I didn't actually include in the tutorial, and that's the ability to jump and kick off walls. And on my Discord, players have been sharing really crazy footage where, in rooms like this with a really high ceiling, they are jumping and kicking off enemies to get loads of airtime they can use to get really stylish kills. In the arcade mode, you get points for stylish kills, and um, getting that airtime and killing enemies upside down really can rack up your score. I, I, I didn't expect players would figure out more advanced stunts like this, um, but there's a lot of really cool footage of, of players doing stuff like that. Uh, I've been really thrilled with the, how players figured that out. Uh, and in one last clip, yeah, you could see uh, some content that wasn't featured in the demo. Uh, a lot of players asked for enemy outlines to help discern them, so you can see I've added them here. And players asked for a double shotgun, which you see I'm rocking right now. I hope you enjoyed this preview of Severed Steel. It's slated for PC release late summer of this year. And if you like what you saw, definitely give it a wishlist on Steam. If you are a console player, there are also PlayStation 4 and Xbox One releases planned for uh, shortly after PC. Uh, thanks again.